Not my problem. That's how Melania Trump is reportedly feeling about her husband's latest legal pickle. This fourth indictment is another problem for her husband, not for her, a source tells People magazine. Melania is also keeping her distance physically, staying at Trump Tower in Manhattan for the summer, while Trump is headquartered 60 miles away at his country club in Bedminster, New Jersey. Stephanie Grisham served as Melania's chief of staff at the White House. Would you say that they are living sort of separate lives right now? I would say that they're living the exact same lives that they've always lived. Uh, each of them is very independent, but they do speak on the phone all of the time, or they did at least when I was around. Um, and she does join him on the weekends. And there are fears today for the safety of the members of the grand jury that indicted Trump after their names and addresses were made public by Trump supporters. That's now all circulating on social media, with experts saying that some anonymous users are calling for violence against members of the jury. Donald is and always has been a frightened little boy. Trump's estranged niece, psychologist Mary Trump, says his social media attacks on the prosecutors and judges assigned to his trials are likely to make things worse for him, but he can't help himself. He used to throw temper tantrums strategically to get his way. It's not strategy anymore. The unconscious fear, terror, is so strong that he cannot realize that doing what he's always done is at this time not going to get him what he wants. In fact, quite the opposite. Trump has pled not guilty to all three of the earlier indictments against him. He must surrender to the sheriff in Georgia by Friday of next week.